Bitcoin has been on a steady decline for a while now. It was trading near $23.00 early today and has been on a steady decline ever since. It was trading at $21.800 during the US session. Despite this, now is not the time to panic and sell your crypto holdings. The price has the potential to go back up over time as long as there is no major change in regulations or government intervention in the market. As long as you have some Bitcoin left in your portfolio to buy back into when the price drops again, you should be fine. One of the reasons behind a strong selling trend in the crypto market is a report by SEC investigating Kraken Exchange. According to reports, the Security Exchange Commission will be investigating crypto to crypto exchange Kraken for violating securities laws. Bloomberg has been speculating about a possible settlement for the last few days, suggesting that it could take place soon. Kraken is a digital crypto assets trading platform that lets customers buy and sell Bitcoin, Ethereum, and Dogecoin. The exchange's fourth largest by volume, according to the CoinGecko data, has been accused of wrongdoing by federal authorities. In November, Kraken agreed to pay the U.S. Treasury Department's Office of Foreign Assets Control $362.158.70 for apparent violations of sanctions against Iran in September, Anthony Ripley, the incoming CEO of BCH, Bitcoin Cash, said that the company had no plans to delist any coins or tokens that a. In January, the SEC levied charges against the two largest exchanges in terms of trading volume, Genesis and Gemini. These charges were for offering unregistered securities. The Securities and Exchange Commission Chairman Gary Gensler believes that many cryptocurrencies, but not Bitcoin, are unregistered securities. Securities are investment tools that raise capital through the public and private markets. The number of crypto-related enforcement actions has grown significantly in recent years. This can be explained by the fact that the body is trying to regulate the space to ensure people's safety and financial well-being. According to Gensler, the cryptocurrency industry is substantially non-compliant despite the fact that there are already clear rules in place to safeguard consumers. Nonetheless, more work needs to be done to ensure the safety of investors. Digital asset exchanges are under close scrutiny by U.S. regulators following the collapse of mega-company FTX in December 2017. That being said, the market is uncertain and investors are staying away from the crypto market. Coinbase shares closed down more than 